Hey guys, so we didn't vlog the last two days, but I'm just here for a quick little check-in. So unfortunately, this little one here has COVID. Yes, they have COVID. Um, everybody in the house tested negative. So I don't know you guys, I don't know what it was. Um, we did have like family gathering for New Year's Eve and Christmas. My in-laws were in town from California. So it very well could be that um, I think we've been doing a really good job of keeping her protected and away from people. We don't do the pass the baby around game or anything like that. So it really bummed me out that she, she got COVID. Um, when we go out to the store for whatever reason, she stays completely covered up inside her car seat. So I'm really sad. We went to the hospital yesterday because she uh, was running a fever. It got all the way up to 102.5, I wanna say. And so they had to test her for RSV, flu, COVID. Um, and they mentioned having to transfer her over to a bigger hospital if all those things came back negative to test her for lumbar, give her a lumbar test for, um, what's the word? Something with the M. COVID test came back positive, so it ruled that out. Do you want to say hi? Say hi, G. Say hi, G. Hold on. <laughs> hi, G. Oh, oh, oh. Say hi. Say hello, my new YouTube family. She actually has not been like super fussy or anything at all. She's legit just running a fever. Bless you. She's legit just running a fever. Everything else is like normal, which the doctor said was kind of scary because uh, with infants that are this small, they don't really show the signs, so we don't know what to look for. Yeah, so we tested the kids. Um, they all came back negative. Um, everybody got tested, came back negative. And so here we are. So me and her, her and I, um, we are locked inside this house until she's feeling better. Um, we've been giving her Tylenol and I was getting a little scared because the Tylenol was not helping her at all. The fever was still spiking. It went down to 98 at the hospital. And then ever since we've been home, it just kept going back up. And so we were getting ready to take her back again. Um, but the um, doctor said to switch to Motrin and see if that works. So the Motrin helped regulate the temperature. The temperature dropped. Um, slowly but surely, so we're gonna just keep monitoring her. But well, she did go outside with me, it's the fresh air because I have to get my workout in. I have to make sure that I'm still, you know, maintaining my own mental health. But I think she really enjoys just getting the fresh air and being outside. So the kids are all home from school. Um, so you guys will get to see a little bit of them today. Maybe I'll give them the, the camera and let them just talk. Speaking of kids, there's one of them. Hi guys, today we building a house in mommy's car. You build a house in my car? Yeah. Y'all are outside doing that? Yes. Where are you going? To get toys, toothpaste, and toothpaste. And Why do you need toothpaste? Because I need to brush and to outside. Yep, yeah, and toys. Outside. Yeah. You sure you need to take toothpaste outside? Yep. Yeah, uh, let's go talk to Daddy first. Come on. Okay. Let's see what Daddy says. Come on. Because you say we have to clean up and we can't do that. So. What, Jay? I said clean up so you guys take out workout stuff and guys, build. Guys, look. It's my lucky day. So these are the places where people can't come in my house. And these are, if you have like stress flags, you put those on your leg. And these are the resort entrances you have to like, The resort entrance? Yeah, no, wait, this is the door you have to like open Looks it. like the resort we went to. Uh, and this is my bathroom. Doesn't have much. And then <laughs> um, these are my pillows. And these are the things of my underwear. You can stretch them out. And so Avery. <laughs> What you talking about? You need some toothpaste. What does toothpaste have to do with what y'all are doing? So I need toothpaste and toothbrush and toys for my house. Um, <laughs> wait, some. 
Yes, go ahead. Why I not? Forgot. Guys, I just got back from the supermarket and I found a super rare COVID-19 mask. So let me add it to my house. But I don't know where to put it because it's not a COVID-19 mask. Yes, it is. That's daddy's workout mask. Crazy. But well, actually it's not my COVID. It's gonna be my dog because the eye guys it's gonna be my dog because no, it's gonna be my COVID-19 mask. So I'm gonna put hey, this. Hey, she wants to make, she's just pretending to do toothbrush and toothpaste and a whole bo box of slime. Toothpaste, money. Okay guys, so it's basically, I'm pretending I live in Florida, so it's basically bedtime for me. No, you're not getting no inside my car with all that stuff. It's basically Hi. nighttime. Why are you going to house? So my legs are a little bit. Well then, try the fake tears. I love this So. Good night, you're guys. Not all that, um, See, you're not putting that you in the car. In the How about y'all build a house morning. over here? Aww. Can I at least keep my house? Not inside. Not inside, the, not inside the car. Babe, get your daughter. Okay, bye. Just crying for no reason. Don't hit daddy's car. He wasn't finished talking. Too bad to say. Y'all see how the kids just argue with me? trick me you're not sleeping hi hi baby you're not sleeping hi did you trick mama did you trick mama look at that tummy okay so because we um have been parking it i made like this little baby basket that i could just keep <laughs> on the couch or even when we transfer over to the bed with like her meds, Motrin Tylenol, extra onesies, binkies, thermometers, breast has for me, um, bibs, wipes, diapers, all kind of stuff. Um, if you guys have been following for a long time, you know all the babies get one of these. Jade had the monkey, Avery had the, I wanna say Winnie the Pooh or the bear. Uh, Callie had the gray elephant, and then Gigi has the pink elephant. I have this cute little soft, cushy pillow. Um, I'm going to have to link the company below, but they sent me a whole bunch of, like, um, cool baby products to use that are, like, super <laughs> convenient for a newborn. So, yeah. Ugh. I was making my coffee, so I'm going to finish that. I'm gonna do this instead. Stay right there for two minutes. Don't go over till I tell you to, okay? Avery lost her mind. She lost her mind. She just coming in here collecting stuff that she finna take and put, put in my car. It's in the drawer. Hello. You got a sick baby. Bro. You so tired. Can I cuss on him? Yeah, it's our channel. Okay, well, bring. don't eat hers. You can have those later. We're just really good. Bro, I gotta get mine. My life in order. I look like I've been losing fights. <laughs> Dad, your phone is getting on my nerves. Every time I click on something on Netflix, it's spamming. This is how I'm feeling. This is how we do it. I guess I can do it. I got so much shit to I'm gonna do. show this to Jade. Make her jealous. <laughs> Cheers! Not me drinking and eating like this for you to pull out some vitamins. Hi! How are ya? <laughs> Say hi, guys. Go, 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 
Got that. What are you gonna do with the phone? Callie, Callie. What you making, Bean? Callie. Her room is my favorite room in the house because it's so refreshing and just bright. She has like a super nice lighting from this little window. Uh, I'm trying to find a, what do you call it, a little cushion thing to go in here to make her a little nook, but I can't find one anywhere. Anyways, we're going to be converting her bed either into a toddler bed or we're going to get her a twin bed to go in here and then let the baby have her crib. It's so funny now with like the fourth baby, there's so much stuff I did not buy. Not because I passed it down. Because honestly, I just, I throw stuff out and I just get new stuff. But like this right here, that was Callie's. She hated it. The baby doesn't like it, but now Callie loves it. She wants to sit in it at her big age of one and a half and swoop, swoop, swoop back and forth. Hey, Callie. Hi, Callie. Are you grocery shopping? Hmm? You did not nap at all. Anyway, so the plan is for eventually Callie and the baby to uh, be in a room together. Whether we have four bedrooms or five, I want them together. Um, just because Jaden Avery experienced it, and I think it helped them even though they fight. So I want them two to be together because they're closer in age. Um, Callie is 18 months and she's almost two months. Um, but the rest of them are all three years apart. Callie is one, Avery's four, Jay's seven, Jay's about to be eight, Avery's about to be five. So yeah. This little girl just really minds her own business. Callie. Kelly, hi. hi. Mwah, blow kiss. Give me a kiss. Mwah. Mwah. Oh, you're so sweet. She woke up and is right back asleep. Her temperature went down so much, so I'm feeling a lot, like a lot better. Kelly. You don't see me here. You don't see me right here. This one right here, building all day. Blocks, stacking stuff. She Avery did the same thing, but they just stack, stack things, building things all day. <gasps> uh oh. <gasps> you got it. I'm gonna go downstairs and see what your sisters are up to. You wanna go bye bye? Hey, you wanna go bye bye? Callie. I know Avery's about to be upset, but she's about to get her hair washed because school. I didn't do it yesterday because the baby was in the hospital, but despite how much time and effort it takes to do everybody's hair, wash everybody's hair. Mine, Callie's, Aries, Jay's. Um, I can't let them go out the house looking any kind of way. Which brings me to my second thought. I need to wash Jay's hair too. So maybe I'll vlog that for y'all, but I can't do both. I can't vlog while I'm washing their hair. Shout out, I don't know.